protection and privilege, registering ship in Gibraltar. Due to its strategic location at the entrance of the Western Mediterranean, Gibraltar has historically been a maritime center and has naturally evolved its own portfolio of maritime services including a ship register. The procedures for registering a ship are simple and efficient, and the current tax regime makes Gibraltar an attractive venue for registering ship. Gibraltar was captured in 1704 by the British and has remained British since. Gibraltar now enjoys British dependent territory status with a measure of self government in what are termed defined domestic matters, with Britain enjoying responsibility for Gibraltar's foreign affairs. As such, Gibraltar is part of the EU under Article 227.4 of the Treaty of Rome by virtue of Britain's membership with special derogation from the Common Agricultural Policy, the Custom Union and VAT. The Gibraltar Register Given its British dependent territory status, ships registered in Gibraltar are British ships entitled to all the protection and privilege awarded vessels registered at the other British port of registry and fly the red ensign defaced with the armorial bearing of Gibraltar, the castle and keys. Additionally, the Gibraltar Register is classed as an EU member state register as defined in the Annex to the Official Journal of the European Communities. In a communication from the Commission dated the 11 May 2006 to the European Parliament, the Council and others the Commission has updated and rectified the interpretation of Council Regulation EEZ No. 3577 applying the principle of freedom to provide services to maritime transport within Member States maritime cabotage. The Commission has pointed out that ships registered in Gibraltar are entitled to have access to maritime cabotage under the same condition as any ship registered in a member state on the basis that the community set of rules in the field of maritime transport is entirely applicable to ships registered in Gibraltar. The port. Gibraltar port became a Category 1 port of registry on the 19 March 1997 when its Merchant Shipping Act 1993 MSRA came into force bringing it to parity with Bermuda, the Cayman Island and the Isle of Man. The Maritime Administrator, operating under the Gibraltar Government's Ministry of Tourism and Transport, had the registry. Under Section 6 of the MSRA, the Maritime Administrator is required to keep a register of ship registered or provisionally registered, including bare boat registration, as well as a register of ship under construction. The registry doesn't run on a commercial profit-making basis, but rather on the basis of its stated objectives of facilitating international trade and commerce by providing the service of a maritime register committed to the highest standard of safe operation of ship and the protection of the marine environment. Whilst the Gibraltar government carries out its role, function and obligation as a flag state as well as a port state, it does so under the guidance provided by the United Kingdom, which is the primary party to all international conventions. The registry has enjoyed significant growth in the last few years particularly as a flag of choice for those shipping companies wanting to conduct intra-European trade. This is as a direct result of Gibraltar registered ship being considered as vessels of a member state register and the favorable tax climate for shipping companies in Gibraltar. This advantage is coupled with a well-run register which is focused on the needs of its client and responsive to their concern has cemented the Gibraltar registry as a successful and progressive port of registry. 
principal features of the Gibraltar registry and flag. Registrable ship. All type of vessel are registrable under the Gibraltar flag save for the following exception. A ship whose first construction was completed more than 20 years before commencement of the year in which application is made unless the written approval is first obtained from the maritime administrator whose own approval is subject to the consent of the Minister of Tourism and Transport. Ship with a nuclear reactor fishing boats and ship whose condition is unsatisfactory so far as safety and pollution are concerned. Qualified Person Section 7 of the MSRA set out the basic qualification of person to own a Gibraltar registered ship which are as follows. Bodies corporate or legal entities incorporated established or registered in Gibraltar. Bodies corporate or legal entities incorporated, established or registered in a member state of the EU provided that they either have a principal place of business in Gibraltar or have appointed a Gibraltar resident to act as their representative person. Foreign maritime entities being a lawfully existing foreign entity whose place of incorporation, establishment, or registration provide the power to own and operate ship and permits it to shoot or be shoot in the name of the entity. British citizen, British dependent territory citizen, British overseas citizen, person who under the British Nationality Act 1981 are British subject. Person who under the Hong Kong British nationality under 1986 are British nationals overseas. Citizen of the Republic of Ireland, nationals of any member state of the European Union, nationals of any state party to the European Economic Agreement. The above shows the flexibility of the register as regard ownership. A particular advantage to ship owners who already have established companies to own their vessel under a different flag and are considering reflagging to Gibraltar bear boat charter registration. Provisional and bare boat charter registration. The legislation permit the provisional registration while a ship is at sea and bearboard charter registration into and out of the Gibraltar register, section 32 and 33, in the case of the former, a provisional certificate of registry will be issued pending the permanent registration of the vessel and will have validity for a period of 90 days. In the case of the latter, the applicant charterer must be in possession of the ship under the bearboard charter and must be qualified person to own a British ship as set out above. The applicant, if incorporated outside of Gibraltar, must appoint a Gibraltar resident to act as its resident agent. Additionally, the applicant must execute an undertaking that whilst the ship is bareboat registered under the Gibraltar flag, it will not only fly the flag of any other registry, nor show at the home port or any other port than Gibraltar.